What's going on guys? Welcome to the third part of the Shike and Money Flow tutorial video mini-series. Uh, where we left off, we actually calculated the Shike and Money Flow, now we actually want to chart it up. So, if you don't have the sample data code, uh, the link is in the description for that code, and down here is the actual code, so just do a nice highlight, uh, and then copy it, and paste it into an empty script. So we'll just do that. So once you've pasted the code in there, uh, scroll up to that little empty slot there. And now go over to what we've been coding. And you want to just highlight and copy and paste the entire, uh, basically all the way down to the whole function and then the actual calling of the function. And paste that between here. And then you don't have to fix the indentation with two tabs over. And now that we've got... Uh, this, what we need to do is actually um, give it some variables since it returns two bits of data. So we'll just say CMF uh, date and CMF I don't know, Y. <laughs> this is the Y axis there. Equals that. And then we want to just do um, the most basic version of this would be uh, ax2.plot uh, and then CMF date minus starting point colon and then cmfy minus starting point colon if you don't know what the minus sp colon is you'll have to watch the uh, charting tutorial series there um, and then we'll just color it white so we'll save that and we'll run that and just get the basic um, line oh we're still plot <laughs> printing all that let's we'll, I'll cancel that in a second so there's your basic um, Jike and Money flow here. Now what we want to do is get that uh, oscillator line in there so we can draw that. So that's the next thing we want to do. So the next thing we want to do is actually maybe uh, fill in that data. Um, and the other thing I noticed was that was the, the oscillator was a little bit large uh, and we have to fix right here in the part where it says well y is less than the length of MFEs we accidentally for the volume range this time we used the x variable so it was always stuck on this last uh, x thing there so this the x's here need to be changed to y's and that will fix uh, that issue now to add the filler what we want to use is a fill between um, within uh, matplotlib. So what I'm going to go ahead and do now is uh, instead of plot use fill underscore between we can leave these the same and then after that we'll remove the w for now um, and we'll say zero so that's the oscillating line and then where uh, equals and then we have to convert it to a numpy array, so we always say numpy.array, and that'll convert it to an array. And we want to use uh, this right here, so I'm going to just copy and paste CMF date uh, like this. So where CMF date, uh, or actually we want CMFY, where CMFY. And then sp colon wherever that is less than or equal to zero, we want um, that to fill between. And then face color, we're going to say that equals uh, or greater than or equal to zero. I think I said less than. Gee, sorry. There's like a dog like barking in the background. I don't know if y'all can hear it, and it's driving me nuts. So stopping me from thinking and then alpha equals 0 0.5 so that should be it let's check this make sure everything gets closed off so that where clause uh, let's see where let's see I think the where clause is going to get closed off then yeah now let's check it again okay cool so now we want to highlight this copy that and paste another one this time it's going to be where it is less than zero less than zero and we're going to want to make it red 
Okay, so we'll save that, we'll run it. And let's plot up Apple again. Oh, I forgot to get rid of that stuff again. Anyway, uh, so here's our oscillator now with, with Apple and the correct uh, oscillations there. Yeah, and so that is our uh, Shiken money flow. Uh, as you can see, as the money you know is entering into it, it goes up, and as money leaves down here, it goes down, and then, and so on. So that's how to do that. That's how to plot it up. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, thanks for watching. Thanks for the support and the subscriptions. And until next time.